right, all right, we should be live yet again here at the Hannibal Show. Let's see here. We should be live on both Bumble and on YouTube, I believe. And that seems to be the case. So, I've been thinking about our uh, playthrough during the beta, and I, I do think we're going to do a Talari only Let's Play. Where uh, we're, of course, going to be focusing on the profits. Yes, yes. So uh, our usual house rule is we're only allowed to trade within a certain faction. We're only allowed to, um, you know, uh, we're not allowed to mine asteroids for profits. What else did we have? We, we usually have a bunch of house rules. But now we're going to be just limiting ourselves to, to Lottie Tech only and Tiladi ship only and of course Tiladi crew only. So um so that is going to be our our plan. We're gonna be uh playing the uh unworthy entrepreneur. We have played this uh, in the past. The connection that binds us no, excuse me, excuse me. Talking here. There we go. No, are you gonna be talking? Dear Yololio Sandurus Rosiris Eleven. You never were the shiniest egg in the clutch. Your piloting abilities were overshadowed by your egg sibling, Ruziris V. Your lack of management skills put to shame by Ruziris IX. And you didn't show as much interest in my endeavors as Ruziris II. Your brazen display of financial incompetence was quite a disappointment. But now, as the final balance is calculated and nothing else matters anymore, I finally understand that your interests lay elsewhere. All right, so this is a fairly decent start. Um, eventually, we're going to be packing up the station and moving it somewhere else. Because uh, we are going to start with a uh, sunflower production station. Uh, we could try and make it profitable. But I do think that our um, profits lay elsewhere. Uh, we also start with uh, two ships, a Castrel Scout and a Vulture Transport. Now, uh, the Thelani has gotten a whole bunch of new ships, uh, large and capital ships, uh, which um, is going to be nice. So, uh, s since they have like the, the most amount of new ships, I kind of felt like that was kind of... What we were going for. Also, the Argon has gotten a whole bunch of new ships. Actually, that's a lie. They have gotten two new ships: the Behemoth and um, the Colossus. Uh, other than that, they don't have any interesting new stuff. But anyways, let's jump into the game. At this point, I no longer care about the ruination you are about to bring upon your inheritance. You do your own thing and find pleasure in whatever it is that you enjoy. Your mismanagement may even create opportunities for others who are still devoted to finding their happiness and profits. And who knows? Maybe your unconventional methods could even be an advantage in the current market and benefit you financially. But who am I misleading? Yours faithfully, Sanduras, Ruziris, Liberis, too. <sighs> oh, we are in the disappointment to the family, but that's okay. We don't need family, do we? Uh, to go places and do things that have never been done before. That's what living is all about. Michael Collins? Well, I don't know. I don't know. I, I do like to do things that I've done before. Wait, also... Um... We need to get make sure that the chat. Here we go. Hi, the professional streamer at your service. So, we start with a Kestrel and a trading ship, a trading vessel. Let's see, that is our Kestrel. Um, I'm also curious. Were they crewed? Let's have a look here. It seems like, um, yeah, we have like a half a star uh, pilot. Oh, very good. This is a little bit of a better pilot um, in the trader. Now, we're going to have to set up some trade orders here to make this work. Let's have a look. Let's see what we should do. 
we should make sure that our uh, organization has a decent logo. Um, do we want to have that? Didn't we call the previous one the Bad Egg Colony? How about this one? We got a little golden coin. Profits. Hmm. Let's do that. Let's see how that looks. We, um... Um, excuse me. Can we, um... Vulture Vanguard. View that externally, please. Let's want to see how the logo looks. Simple. It's a golden coin. Gold brass latinum. Right? Anybody got that reference? Um, so, how do we want this to do? I, I think we're going to try and make this station profitable, uh, which means we're going to have to go into the uh, uh, logical overview. All right, so we kind of would like to buy um energy cells, and we would like to buy water, and we would like to sell uh, those. All right. Now, we don't actually have any money in the station, so we're going to have to um, pause at some of that. And I think we'll just have this one going here. I just want to make sure that all the pilots and all our crew actually aren't lardy, because if not, we we'll have to fire them. Right. Horribly racist thing of me to do, but that's just the way it is. Uh, you seem like a Tiladi, even though you don't kind of look like a Tiladi. Yeah, they all have weird long names. That is very Tiladi. Okay. So you are basically just going to go and trade for Commander. Uh, that's basically what we're going to do. And then we're going to be docking our Kestrel here. Uh, not much Estrell, we Vanguard. have. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. I wonder what all that do -do 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 sound is. Hopefully not too bad. Uh, we also need to find a name for our enterprise here. Uh, let's see here. If I recall correctly, there was a um, thing here, somewhere around here. Uh, I kind of feel like we're missing something. Yeah, there we go. We're missing the cockpit. Right, let's uh, perform some long range scans here. Uh, maybe it doesn't show up on the... Oh, there it is. Yeah. So, this is going to be a data vault. Down here, yeah, there it is. The pink one. We just got stopped yesterday. It's just a pew-pew weapon. That's fine. We can live with a pupil weapon. Let's Unknown let's object. Select that, and we're going to start with going on a spacewalk, because who doesn't like a little spacewalk? With our little lizard person. So, the good thing is now these are marked. Let's stop right about here. And then we'll get out. Estrel, Vanguard. It'll do. And, um... If I put correctly, we're a whole bunch of them on the... All the panels here. We need to interact with. I might be wrong. On the side. Mm. No one on that side? For reals? Underneath? Uh, doesn't quite look like it. Alright, let's... Um, Go up here because we do see we have a 
In here we need to fix. Spray some super glue on it. There we go. And same here. Uh, oh no. Hopefully that's uh, not going to be... I wasn't there supposed to be one here as well. Did we skip one? No. Alright, so let's go through the open compartments. And we can also go into scan mode. And we'll see if we can find any things here that we can interact with. Nothing? So yeah, what I'm kind of thinking is, we're going to set up our raid center in the headquarters, I believe. Maybe not. Uh, was there nothing here to interact with? Excuse me. Right, somebody's fighting the Xenon, which is nice. It's someone that means it does It isn't me who's fighting it. Alright, nothing in here. How about top side? Oh, there is one. Excuse me. And then this one open up. And is this what we we're looking for? This is kind of what we we're looking for. Container. Container. Yoink. Some space fly eggs and some stuff. We're still missing the data node, which is in here somewhere. I don't see any other compartments that has opened up. Oh, we're definitely missing one. It's very typical. I mean, we went through all of these and there was only two compartments on top. But luckily we have a big oxygen tank, so shouldn't be worried. Oh, I see it. I see it. It's over here. There we go. Alright, does that mean we have fixed the entire thing? I bet you it is on top. The uh, data node. Uh, like maybe in here. There it is. There we go. Alright. So we got some... Some gold. Oh, wait, have they done something with the... Uh, Tanabe train station? Alright, now we just need to find our freaking ship. Should be... Here. Estrel Vanguard. All right, Estrel Vanguard. Now I'm tempted to go and do the um, uh, the uh, starting quest for the Boron. Estrel on Vanguard the headquarters. <laughs> oh, I guess we'll. Oh, let's see here. Yeah, I kind of... Let's go over here. It could just be the lighting that makes it look... I don't remember that turkey's ring around the... The ring here. So that is our station. Right here. T. T. -he. Tour bus. B. Why is it, um... Oh! Oh, it's just a little bug. Alright, fair enough. Fair enough. Alright, let's uh, see if we can take on this little poor boss. It's a criminal scum. Has failed to pay their taxes in time. 
Mr. Finus is going to be upset. Yeah, this uh, seemed like a broken thing. Sometimes they they break. Uh, like they, they they are there, but they are not. So even if the man a direct hit on it, it doesn't actually hit it. So it's not even there. All right, we're going to be heading. Me? T. Freaking uh, Xenon. That's not nice. Well, doesn't seem to be a problem. We should deal with. Let's, um. My way. Uh, where is us? We are. Oh, there it is. There's the highway. I, I think it only goes one way. It only goes this way. We will eventually get a little scouting squadron, I guess. Oh, another thing we need to do. We kind of need to set up our global orders. Alright, so... If we are attacked, use judgment and escape. Um, we'll just ignore it. Yeah, you can just go through that. If you find an abandoned ship, um, found a lockbox, just ignore it. Don't notify me, please. Um, default global response for piracy. Um, escape. And military ship, you can attack them. Default response for founding contraband. Uh, let's just collect the drops. And same here. Mm, you can probably notify me if you find any nasty stuff. Uh, police interactions. We're going to be complying. So we're going to be nice to lobbies. Probably don't need to uh, notify me. Uh, then we're going to be using universal building methods. Uh, default setting for automatic supply. I. That seems good. All right. I think we have it. I think we have it. Yeah, we're not going to be entering that highway as it takes us back. Hmm. We found any stations on the way? Probably not. Can we get... This guy to fly out here. Fly here. Just do some exploratory missions. Why so many medical stations? That all we had. Right, well, when you're done there, you can go and dock here. Let's also make sure that he is entering system Trinity Sanctum. I can dock. Trinity Sanctum. Okay, we kind of missed the highway here. And we're just going to attach ourselves to one of them. And then we should be able to get right in here. Gonna hit the highway. 
my way. Yeah, there we go. Entering we... system. Yeah, let's right just do the, the ring around the roses, I guess. Oh, hey, people. Waiting this Entering road here. system. Profit center alpha. I thought it should say if we had done it or not. Entering system. Silent witness. Silent witness. So uh, I guess next station or next then. Um, maybe when we get the Hatikva quest line. Entering system. Hatikva's choice. I'll accept that. And we're also going to get the... Troublesome agent. No. Nope. Preemptive defensive. What is this? I'll build a defensive station. Peace and stability. Um, alliance. Entering system. Yeah. Argon Prime. Right. We'll uh, talk to him. This automated message is being broadcast exclusively in the proximity of Heretic's Head. Signs indicate that we will imminently witness the extraordinarily rare reactivation of a jump gate. The Alliance of the Word has assembled an expedition to study this rare event. Yeah, we'll just uh, have to do some exploration first. Uh, did we not? Yeah, we did. Get all the money in there. So that our trading vessel could, um, could operate. Entering system. Holy vision. All right. I wonder if it's gonna go through Trinity Sanctum 3, we're probably Entering gonna be system. just continuing the same plane. approach. Entering system, Ias Mists. Ias Mist. Entering system. Unholy retribution. So, what I think we'll do, I think we'll try... Oh, wait, that's going to be a little bit problematic, isn't it? Mm, I'm not quite sure if we're going to Entering system. Trinity Sanctum. Get some profits going. Why to... Right away. A feed factory. Entering system. Bright promise. All right. Uh, which one? Entering system. Profit center alpha. Let's just activate the um... autopilot. Disengaged. Autopilot. Engaged. There we go. Autopilots. Mm. Entering system. Silent witness. So we're going to be heading into... Um, uh, Heretic's End. Entering system. Atikva's choice. I think we forgot yesterday. It, it was to see the um, 
the boron um, thing. Or on um, manager office. Are you just going to be stopping here? Autopilot disengage, entering system, Morning Star. Yeah, that's right, we need to go through Morning Star as well. Completely forgot about that. There is a jump gate over here, which I do believe leads into the territory. We should potentially... Well, maybe not with this ship. I was kind of thinking maybe we could have um, have used a um, ship and did the um, um, I think was uh, I think we quest line because then we will get attacked by some pirates, which will. Um, Potentially allow us to pirate some pirate ships. Pirate the pirates. Engaging. Morning Star Three. Go. Heretic Sand. Entering system. Heretics end. Attention! Denizens of Heretics End! Please evacuate the designated area immediately. Alright, let's stop here for a minute. What's going on? Sir, we are picking up an unusually high energy signature. It seems like a town. What is? Right, let's just go and say hi to Bozo. Goodness me! It worked! Yes! I made the jump! Ha <laughs> ha! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Excuse me, traveler! Did you hear the Alliance broadcast? I wonder! Would you be interested in collaborating with one of the greatest scientific minds of our time? Maybe. I am Bozo Tar. As far as I am aware, I am the only Bor on this side of the network schism. I am currently in the market for some personal assistance. Should you be interested, please do come for a face-to-face -face chat. When you have time, of course. Yes, yes. Unknown station. Uh, Docking your... aborted. I don't know. Where is your docking, docking station? Docking granted. There it is. Did that well. Uh, we probably don't have any. docking software on this little. ship of ours. Uh, excuse me. Can we back up a little bit? Thank you. There we go. Sir? Yes. So that is a Thaladi. There's people all over the place. Welcome aboard the mystery installation. I do apologize for the mess. I only recently escaped my split captors. Can you believe they forced me to develop weapons? This installation is equipped for habitation of all races, and this room seems to be some sort of research area. 
I expect I could spend years poring over the data contained in these systems. Hello there. Hello there. Is there anything I can help you with? Yes, I have already made some progress. There appears to be several things we can research at this facility. Please take a look. Oh, I will. Alright, so they basically just want us to go in here. As you can see, there is much to do. Yes. I personally find mention of this teleportation irresistible. But I leave it up to you. One day, Bozo. One day. What are people we? Uh, I kind of wonder... Oh, we broke the freaking thing already. Alright. Estrel, Vanguard. And then I guess we are heading over here to the um, jump gate over here where they're trying to get in contact with the bozos. No, sorry, the bo borons. The bozos, yes. So, my idea here is to potentially claim Heretic's End for ourselves. And set up an off branch of uh, the Teladi Empire here. Intervention core. They don't like us very much. Wait, minus 15? Uh, are they going to be attacking us on sight? Question, question. Uh, no, but they're not happy with us. Right. One day we might want to trade with the Taladi. Oh, sorry, the Terrans. So they jump through, and so shall we. Entering system. Watchful gaze. Preliminary scans indicate that this system is uninhabited. No 
sign of boron or any other kind of life, biological or artificial. This cannot be true. Are you certain that the sensors are not malfunctioning? It has been so long. I really thought this might be the day I finally reconnect with my kin of the Finn. Take heart, Boron Exile. You may yet be a step closer to your reunion. Explorer, we need some detailed system mapping. The task is in your hands. There is much to learn here. remember just gonna be this is where we found the broken boron ship isn't it is that the thing we're seeing out there maybe I think it is I think I, I think it is. By the way, have we, um, see logic level view. Have we gotten any, we are getting some energy cells coming in here. Um, yes, yes. Preliminary data has identified some points of potential interest. We're having trouble locking on to exact locations at this range. What's the ship? But we have to go and find the space rock first. Which I believe is this one. Unknown object. Asteroid. Hold on. I think I am picking up. Oh no. Never mind that. Nothing of interest here. This system's peculiar conditions make getting accurate readings rather troublesome. Newman Kayet, sir. Our team confirms that the Heretic's End Gate does indeed contain the coordinates to the Kingdom End system. The timing cannot be coincidental, can it? Just after we received word from the Boron? Is it possible that their experiments were somehow related to the gate reinitialization? Coordinates and timing are relevant, but not conclusive. The fact of the matter is that this is definitely not Kingdom End. Interstellar messenger drones are not the fastest form of communication. We do not know what has occurred on the Boron side since their last message. Theoretically, a connection between the two gates is possible. That is just a theory. It could well be that the systems were linked in the distant past. Yes. Unfortunately, a theoretical compatibility does not mean much in itself. If activating or reprogramming these gates were easy, I am certain I would have overcome the challenges long ago. The split didn't exactly give you a choice over your research focus. Could this be the Boron? Could they really have unlocked jump gate technology? Perhaps. Perhaps not. At this point, any further hypothesis would be mere speculation. Until we have more evidence, keep your ideas off general comms. If you must elaborate your theories, feel free to put them in writing. Yeah, I kind of would like to see where we're going to oh be my. jumping the ship. Could that be? Maybe. By the Trinity, a boron vessel. My instinct says we should take a closer look. Your ship's sensors are picking up a weak energy signature amongst the debris. Assistant, I think you should suit up and investigate. Of course you think so, uh, but I kind of would like to save us some time and find out how to get into here. Before we jump into our spacesuits, I remember this was a little bit awkward.
Was it in here? We'll park the sh uh, ship in the middle of the broken ship here. Yeah. Yes. Estrel, Vanguard. See if you can repair the panel to gain access. Yeah, where is the panel? Derelict ship. Yeah, this is kind of why I wanted to... Um, Get a little bit closer. Estrel, Vanguard. 1.6 kilometers away while flying. Just 8 meters per second is uh, it's not quite ideal. Alright, give me a seat, please. Thank you. Sure, it is here. Estrel Vanguard. Well, that saved us like twenty minutes of uh, flight, I think. Yeah, it should be in here. Also, there we go. One box repaired. Derelict one, ship container. One black box recovered. Running decryption and reconstruction algorithm. The data is woefully incomplete, but it appears that this was an outpost of some manner. There are signs of an attack from several directions. It seems that the operators would have had little, if any, time to react. How frustratingly peculiar. I am forwarding all of this to our esteemed expedition commander. Perhaps he can garner more clues. I have my doubts, though. Kestrel, Vanguard. Oh. Now what? Explore. You have an unidentified ship on an intercept trajectory. This is our first contact in the newly opened network. We have no idea of who they are, or their intentions. Investigate, and if possible, make contact, but maintain vigilance. Oh my! Aliens! You! Please, oh, do not chance. be afraid. I shall disengage my armament. Alright, blast them to smithereens! No, and we'll Greetings! I am so pleased to make your acquaintance. Incredible! Finally, contact with our aquatic allies. Bozota, are you receiving this? Scientists indicated that they were 
working on such a task. Please, can you direct us towards Kingdom End? You were in contact with Kingdom End? That is marvelous news. It has been decades since we were cut off. We have heard nothing in all that time. The severing of the connection with Nishala has been indescribably distressing for all of us. My system is in profound turmoil. I... I... To meet a fellow Boron after all these years is an incandescent joy. But to find that you, too, are cut off from the homeworld is a misery. More than you know, Bosota. We have all mourned this loss. Hmm. But without access to Kingdom End, your Queen and Parliament, how do you govern yourselves? After the severance, there was a period of chaos, until a royal steward was appointed. I have had dealings with him. It would be my pleasure to make an introduction. We must make haste. There is much to be discussed with your leadership. Follow me, you cavalcade of curious creatures. Wayfinder. A born society not headed by a queen? This is somewhat hard to fathom. Indeed, Bosotar. From your own experience, you understand the pain of separation. I doubt other species appreciate the biological depth of our harmonious societal interconnection. It was worse than it is now. It used to be that all our systems were isolated. Severed, not just from Kingdom End, the Queen and Homeworld Nishla, but also from each other. Fortunately, several of our systems reconnected to each other eventually, but none received word from home. Reorganization became a necessity. The provinces adrift, as we call ourselves, were only ever intended to be temporary. But under the royal steward, it has grown into a comprehensive governing body. But some of us have never given up on Kingdom End. Your communication with the homeworld is momentous in the extreme. Not a soul in these systems has found evidence of where the Kingdom End even still exists. Well, let's uh, follow the space fish. Uh, while we do that, let's um, see how we're doing here. Uh, there are still three minutes until they will arrive with some energy cells. Oh, and we also have to do the diplomatic thing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Commonwealth ship. Surely this indicates that our reports are correct. The one storm in gate has indeed resumed its function and brought our province into alignment with our erstwhile allies. You must realize what this means. All the resources of the Commonwealth are now within reach. At long last, a chance to end the shortages. Pick up the pace. Right. I must warn you, the provinces adrift are not awash with the luxuries of the old kingdom. The pain of severance has been constant, but our economy has also suffered. The shortages of essential goods have cut deeply. Reconnection with the network may alleviate some of these issues, at least. Alright, before we go and follow that uh, squid person, let's uh, dot at one of their stations. Uh, and um, the reason why I can't control my ship anymore.
Boron defense platform. Yes, I would like to dock with you, please. Docking granted. And we'll see if we can see the new Boron... Um... Manager office. Doki, sir. Yeah. Sir. A boron capital ship. In all my days. A perfect equilibrium of function and ergonomics. And with such flair. My current abode is penurious in comparison. Mila T, you bring us guests, outsiders, with a fleet no less. What have you been up to? More than that, Royal Steward, I bring momentous news. The fleet. Mm. This paranid led fleet. It came from the dormant gate in watchful gaze. They have communicated with Kingdom End. They have no Kingdom End gate, but they have communication. We are connected to the network once more. My word, the if. Guppy. The delegation seeks an audience. May I? Yes, yes, of course. There is so much to discuss, so much to consider. Royal Steward, would it be in order for me to accompany the delegation? I am sure you have other things to do. Diplomacy is not the same thrill as exploration. Please, Royal Steward, with your permission. Of course, Neela T. By all means, accompany the delegation. Explore. You have displayed some usefulness thus far. I'm tasking you with joining us in meeting the Royal Steward. I may have need of your insights. Do you need my insights for? You have oh, insights. Made an impression on the expedition commander. I sense you are becoming more central to his plans. Join the delegation. Watch this royal steward. I have some experiments to attend to, though I shall keep an eye on you. Successfully docked. There we go. Or on capital ship. Interesting. That's us. Little Tilhadi in the corner there. My Ropalium near explodes with the joy of welcoming esteemed visitors. This historic occasion is the first of its kind. I am Leda V, royal steward of the provinces adrift. On behalf of Her Majesty the Queen and as her loyal servant, it is my profound pleasure to welcome an emissary of the Peronid Empire. And once business is out of the way, I insist you join me on a more informal tour. Esteemed Royal Steward, Lita Wee, thank you for your most gracious welcome. You must forgive me. I, Numankaret, am no Empire Emissary. I represent the Alliance of the Word, a diplomatic form and scientific organization funded by various races across the network. My, my. But do you have letters patent from the Empire? The provinces adrift are in dire straits. We must negotiate terms of assistance. I am compelled to reiterate, I do not speak for the Paranid authorities. Though we do bring news which may bring joy, we have been in communication with Kingdom End. Limited, fragile communication, but communication nevertheless. Some months ago, we received word from your homeworld. It was heartening to discover that the Boron Corps has survived the shutdown and learn of their most ambitious endeavor. Their entire scientific resources are focused on understanding and manipulating Jumpgate technology. We humbly request your permission to investigate the dormant Jumpgates in your territory, and to set up a scientific outpost in the region, should that be required. There are so many implications to consider. This really is momentous. I am afraid I must decline your request, for now. We cannot be precipitous. 
destroy the glistening waters of Nishala. I fail to understand. We ask for no more than your permission. We certainly have no wish to be a drain on your resources. Leader we, they are trying to connect us with Kingdom End. They have communications. Neela T, this obsession with finding home is entirely yours. You may have the luxury of gallivanting around the galaxy in search of miracles, but I, I have responsibilities. I have the welfare of billions of souls to consider. Our guests have already made clear that the outside network, with all its resources, has been unable to connect with our home world. The priority at this juncture is the welfare of our people, and I shall not be distracted from that. Honored host, we will of course expedite communications with the governments of the network. I am sure emissaries are preparing as we speak. Yet, if we could simply... Enough, please. I understand your request, but I do not think you understand what is at stake. Please have patience, but for now, the matter is settled. Outrageous! The Boron Queen's government itself is racing to reconnect, and you decline to facilitate? What kind of royal steward are you? Please! There is nothing to be gained from trading insults. This is absurd! Our work is of the utmost importance! Your What? They just disintegrated him? Nice. <laughs> I think there was a... <laughs> yeah, I think there was a little bug in the cutscene. That certainly could have come better. The yep. ball may not be lost. Alright, let's talk to Lida V. Ah, the silent one from our disappointing introduction. Yes, prophets. Um, perhaps there is a positive solution. Your expedition commander hardly seemed in the mood for positive solutions. I cannot imagine that you presume to speak for him. No, but, um... There is something that we need to... Assistant, perhaps uncovering more context first may help with your solutioneering. Alright, uh, alright, we'll say goodbye and we'll go and talk to the people uh, in the crew quarters, I guess. The Protectorate has determined that this system poses no threat to the citizens of Seoul or the wider network. Our orders are to deploy to a position of more strategic importance. Still, stay alert. None of us know what might be lurking out there. The Alliance of the Ward thanks you for your support. We shall proceed alone from here on. Our military friends are needed elsewhere. The steward and I have had our dip. I am so very sorry you had to witness that embarrassingly discordant display. Leader we and I disagree on much, but he is not a bad person. You know, he is just... scared. Alright, so what is afraid of? I think. He is scared of falling short. He carries the weight of the expectations of the entire provinces. He wants to keep everyone safe, and I think he fears that your expedition will exacerbate an already dangerous situation. Alright, uh, your quest from home was... observation. Oh. You took note of that, did you? Time after time, I approach Leader Wee for the resources to find our way back home. But he has come to the conclusion that efforts spent on this endeavor come at an immediate cost to our people. I would hate for you to get the impression that I do not care for my fellow Boron here. Out on the fringes, I am truly seeking to make a difference for the people. Serving the Queen's subjects is a duty for me. You see, I do not like to draw too much attention to it but I myself am the progeny of stranded minor royals. Before you bow or anything like that, I am not part of the direct line of succession, and that is not how our monarchy works in any case. Yet, it drives me to find a path back home, for the people to once again delight in a reunited, merry realm. Oh, all right. Dangerous situation, you said? Yes. Brought with danger, the oh provinces my. lie uncomfortably close to Kark territory. When Sanctuary of Darkness first connected to the provinces, it triggered regular attacks. We barely managed to protect ourselves with the meager military that we could cobble together. Thankfully, the waves have calmed for now. The Kark incursions eventually ceased. All attempts to communicate with these enigmatic creatures have failed, so I would hesitate to call it a ceasefire. It is more of a lull in hostilities. As you can imagine, 
the situation remained rather fragile. Yes, all right, goodbye. Pleasant travels. So, should we go and talk to uh, Namukret, or should we go and talk to Lida V? Let's go and talk to... Oh, hello. What the Entering heck? system, Great Reef. I think we'll just pass the jump gate. All right, Lida V, let's have a friendly little chit-chat, shall we? Ah, the silent one from yes, a disappointing yes, introduction. Yes, yes. All right, so perhaps there is a positive solution. Um... About the cog threat, uh, we can use force to resolve this permanently. Why can't we? Uh, uh, the silent one from our disappointing introduction. Why don't we get the right? Uh, why are you in this situation? From time to time, I spend the waking nights pondering the very same question. It would be misleading to cast blame for all our miseries on the great shutdown. In fact, when we were first riven from the wider network, the vast majority of our boron systems remained connected between themselves. Isolated from external threats, we commenced a new age of reflection and scientific endeavor. And while this period of peace brought the wealth of Kingdom M to fabulous new heights, we were not complacent. Resources were stockpiled throughout the Queendom, a precautionary measure. Oh, we thought we were prepared, yet in truth we were far from it. We Boron are inherently connected to each other, you see. We thrive on a collective sort of innate affinity. Once that connection was severed, each system found itself in complete isolation. Things fell apart quite quickly, I'm afraid to say. Productivity collapsed catastrophically. Stockpiles were depleted far more rapidly than anticipated, and there was no way to replenish them. After years of disarray, Great Reef finally reconnected with barren shores. Later, it was joined by several other systems. The provinces adrift were founded, but by then the damage was done. We still lacked crucial resources. I contend that it was the collective psychological toll of the severance that caused this, more so than the evident logistical challenges posed by the shutdown. So, uh, if I help, we could... No, I think we need to talk to... I feel like we're missing some of the dialogues here. Uh, crew quarters. I guess we're gonna have to talk to Nilati again, I guess. Hello again, explorer. Oh, hello. Alright, um... Could Pleasant we... Pleasant travels. Just hello again, explorer. Make sure he doesn't fade in and... Out of, um... I think. He is scared of falling short. He carries the weight of the expectations of the entire provinces. He wants to keep everyone safe and I think he fears that your expedition will exacerbate an already dangerous situation. Okay, um, dangerous situation? Yes, fraught with danger. The provinces lie uncomfortably close to Kark territory. When Sanctuary of Darkness first connected to the provinces, it triggered regular attacks. We barely managed to protect ourselves with the meager military that we could cobble together. Thankfully, the waves have calmed for now. The Kark incursions eventually ceased. All attempts to communicate with these enigmatic creatures have failed. So I would hesitate to call it a ceasefire. It is more of a lull in hostilities. As you can imagine, the situation remains rather fragile. Alright, so are you just going to say the same again? Yes, fraught with danger. Of course. <laughs> the provinces lie uncomfortably close to And Kark we can't territory. skip the dialogue. When Sanctuary of Darkness first connected super to annoying. the provinces... Oh, we could. All right. Oh, you took note. Oh, you took note of that, did you? Yeah, it doesn't after seem the time like. I Lido. Pleasant We're travels. Getting anywhere with that dialogue? Let's uh, go down and talk to the monk rats, which should be down on the, the docks here. All right. Who does this fool think he is? Does he not understand the gravity of our mission? Withholding his consent, 
We shall continue without it if necessary. Sounds like rape to me. Mission toward the Klaus minded. Hmm. You may have a point. Yes. Perhaps his simple mind cannot grasp all the variables at play. I wonder if we can help him to see the bigger picture. Lidove is afraid. Yes, you are right. That much is obvious. I cannot help but wonder if there is more to the issue than that. Perhaps he is overly attached to his role as Prime Administrator of the Provinces. A reunion with King Demend would inevitably result in him having to relinquish power and standing. Um, then we finish the cock. Ah, I understand. Cheers. He's worried that our presence will stir up an infestation of the Chitterers. The Alliance of the Ward is certainly prepared to provide assurances that our investigation will not leave him exposed to Ka'ak attacks. Alright. Uh, can we now go and talk to Ledevi? Ah, the silent one. Oh, that ah, just the silent us. one from our disappointing introduction. Yes, perhaps there is a positive solution. Uh, the card threat. There we go. We aim to avoid provocation at all costs. Your commendable commitment to peace is as welcome as it is unexpected. The alliance of the word is to be lauded for its respect for our peaceful ways. Perhaps there is a positive solution. If uh, you help, we could... Use Nile of Ties to increase your standing. I am fully aware of Nila T's royal connections. Is it your opinion of me that I am some petty functionary who can be bought and sold, bribed, by the highest bidder? You misjudge me, and you misjudge Nila T. For all our disagreements, I cannot conceive that she would be party to such a grubby approach. Of course I desire the return of the provinces adrift to the warm embrace of the homeworld. But what kind of servant would I be if I did so at the expense of the welfare of those under my charge? This is all terribly challenging. My instinct is that your expedition is honest in its intent. However, I find your judgment questionable. Well... I feel that I must allow you to proceed in your mission. However, I ask of you, do not make me regret this. With the gate in Watchful Gaze reactivated, to our knowledge only three more dormant gates remain in province space. One is located in Ocean of Fantasy, another in Barren Shores. The final one was discovered by scouts in Sanctuary of Darkness. If Sanctuary of Darkness sounds foreboding, you may find that the name is fitting. It is host to a significant Ka'ak infestation. Urgh. Even uttering the name makes my fins tingle. Yet I must remain firm on the matter. Do not, under any circumstances, engage with the Ka'ak. Every interaction with them results in horrific conflict. You have our word, Leader Wee. We shall do everything in our power to avoid undue provocation. Thank you. And may I bestow upon you a gift? A we gift, have prepared you say? for you a fighter ship. A humble gift, but hopefully it will be of use to you in the times ahead. Explorer, you have done well to secure access for us to continue our mission. Please, claim the scout ship as your own. May it serve you well. Alright, so let's head down to the docking area. I mean, loud. There we go. So, what we're going to do, we're going to be... Where is that scout ship? It's over here, I guess. Uh, so, we're basically just going to strip it down and sell it. Can we not get to it? There she is. Marco. A little Marco. Actually, you know what? We're going to keep it. Uh, for a little while. We need to investigate the dormant gates to formulate the next step of our expedition. I am already familiar with the 
navigate an ocean of fantasy. If you supply me with the necessary equipment and provide me with a few pointers as to what exactly I am to do, it would be my deepest pleasure to assist. Consort, the Alliance shall investigate barren shores. That only leaves the matter of the final gate, the location of which is somewhat more precarious. Explorer, you have excelled thus far. Put that new fighter of yours to good use and find Sanctuary of Darkness. It seems that you are best suited to this task. Can I help? Yes, uh, you can work somewhere else. You can go and work in a new ship here. Hopefully you know how to operate a... I almost said a Klingon ship. A, um... A Boron ship. Confirmed. Yes. Thanks to the newly opened trade routes, we have commenced rebuilding our shipyard. Hmm. Model saving, is that gonna be an issue? You are, nope. of course, most welcome to aid us in our undertaking. <laughs> Your okay, efforts will, of course, be lucratively compensated. Nice. All right. So, what we're gonna do? Um, we're gonna have this Marco. Can we send the Marco down here? I just want to see if we can strip anything away from it. Some shields, some weapons. Some software and some nav beacons. You know what? Let's cancel that. We kind of need those nav beacons. I think we're going to need more nav beacons. Can I tell you to transfer you know, the flares and the nav beacons? I think we're going to have to wait a little bit. Oh, there we go. We got him. All right. Um, we'll send the Marco. Actually, we'll just send it over here. I need the money, don't we? I kind of need the money. So that is 200,000. Almost 300,000. Right, let's go and do that. And then when you're done, you can fly and dock and wait here. Uh, how are you doing? We're just going to dock. Now, have we made any profits here? Uh... I haven't sold anything here. Let's also have a look at the quest. So we need to find a inactive jump gate. I kind of wonder if we should wait a little bit with that. Now there actually is a... Phoenix E. I have arrived at my designated inactive gate. I shall commence taking readings immediately. Yeah, let me just take on this pirate ship. Maybe we could pirate that and strip that down. Oh, oh no, no, no. It's a freaking plunderer. Uh, that's not going to happen. That is not going to happen. Um... Phoenix, E. Okay, so let's head Auto over here. Engaged. So this will bring us to the... Um, this will bring us to the... Um, what should we call it? Uh, the... Um, ship wharf. Or the shipyard. One of them. Which they're currently building. 
So it would be very nice if we actually had... Phoenix, E. Do, 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 do. Don't know what that... That she is. Alright, there we go. We're on shipyard. So, what do we want to do? Phoenix, E. Is, um... Autopilot. Engage. Autopilot. Disengaged. There we go. So what we want to do is get some money. I think we collided. And we um, just stop here. Alright, so what we want to do with that money I'll we'll see how much we could buy a trading vessel for. So do we want to turn? Let's see here, highest preset. Uh, traveling speed 1000. Oh, that's not good. Vulture. That's definitely not good. Ah. I kind of feel like speed is more important here. Deborah says, hi, hello, Deborah. How are you doing? I hope you're having a most, most excellent day, or night, or evening. Pepsi, you could have some Pepsi, because you know what they say, that's right. It might so go in the dark. Mm -mm -mm. <sighs> yummy, yummy. So, let's do a minimum. That's 300,000. Oh, 300, that means we can't afford that. At the moment. Nobody's buying our precious sunflower seeds. It's not even sunflower seeds. It's sunrise flowers. Nobody buying my flowers? Let's see, where is the Marco? We're still on its way, but we're gonna get. Oh, maybe, maybe we'll get enough money for that. So you needed energy cells, basically all the basics. Plus, um, yeah, we could probably remove you and. Over here, let's go to our trading thing here. We would like Blatronics, we would like energy cells, we would like hull parts and water. Not wheat, water. Okay, they sell electronics here. Um, give me a second, Mr. Pirate Man. We'll um, we'll set up a little trade thing here. Uh, yeah. So you're gonna be repeating order here and here. You're gonna be buying whole parts. Buy Nitronics. Uh, yes, and buy full parts. Buy Nitronics and sell Nitronics. Uh, hold parts. Yeah, you will buy hold parts. Confused.
Now all, right? Then why can't we... I hold parts and... Oh, all parts. And then we need to find energy cells. Where are they? Here. By energy cells. And L energy cells. Now water. Have we found any one water? Um Nobody's selling water. All right, fair enough. Now they should be going around doing that. No, I don't think I will. I have to trade filter here. Where is that pirate? There it is. Minotaur, raider. Uh, where was it? Why can I see it on the screen? There it is. All right. Are we ready for some Minotaur Raider pirate fighting? So I'll do a quick save here, just in case this goes south. It's big potential, because we are just flying a tiny little Castrol with a little pew pew weapon. It's probably full of missiles and lasers and all nasty stuff here. Let's try and talk to him first. What do you want? Is that supposed to be funny? Yeah. Something hit us. He's currently preoccupied with something else. You see, we're barely scratching his shield. Uh, which is theoretically a good thing. No He's quicker than us. He has a lot more firepower than we have. Raider. But we have friends, it looks like. Nice. Scan has been completed, and I'm pleased to inform you that nothing untoward has been found. Minotaur, Raider. I'm not talking to you. Okay, he's gonna be blown up. Come on, get some shield back. We are no longer a threat. Ouch. All right. Spare us. All right, we're gonna need him to get some shields back. Are they gonna be blown up? Oh, they have warships here. What do you want, miserable oh, we, wretch? We got him. Abandoning my vessel. Holy moly, we got him, folks. Escape pod. Oh, there's a lot of them. And the pirates get away. Alright, we've got the pirates. Minotaur, Raider. They paid with their lives. And we got stuck with a Minotaur Raider. We're we just gonna claim that ship. Estrel, Vanguard. Um and use it as Oh, well, we're not gonna use it. We're gonna have to wait for the uh... Minotaur Raider. Gonna have to wait for the um, the Marco to do its thing. Uh, 
Uh, we could potentially repair this. This is going to give us a little bit of profits. Profits! Yes. Um, I'm trying to figure out where the... Oh, this is no friend for mine. This is a medium uh, pirate ship. Um, which will uh, yield us a little bit of profit. So if we can figure out where the frick the... Data leak is. Where is it? I found it. There it is. There we go, it now belongs to us. The ship is ours. Nice. So, um... I think we'll just fix her up. Even though it could take a while. Since this is not a Teladi ship, it's just gonna go straight in the bin. We'll sell it to the Argon. I do like some nice ships. Oh gosh, this takes forever. Let's take away the, uh, the thing. You know the thing. Can I just jam something in the space bar here? What did I use before? Like a little switch, switch army knife we can use here. There we go. That's gonna give us, uh, hopefully... So, well, we could cross our fingers for like half a million. Requesting permission to dock. Dogging permission granted. So, the more we can repair it, the more we're going to get for it. So, I'm seeing this as an investment. And fill mine. Hmm. All integrity... Wait, what? Forty-nine, and it jumped down to forty-seven. There we go, fifty percent. All integrity. Nice, nice. Last a lot of uh, super glue and duct tape on it. Um, is somebody shooting at me? I hope not. Got me a little bit worried. More on turned turned on us. Yeah, hopefully this is gonna be worthwhile. Integrity at uh, sixty percent. There we go. So since it's a medium ship, it's gonna take a while. To repair it up. Doing it for profits, guys. Profits. Uh, I guess have to get a little bit uh, into B4. 
the new stuff. Um, yeah, I could show you some of the new stuff. Um, pause the game. So there are some uh, new ships. There are some new sectors. Um, not quite sure where they are. They should they should be here, right? And down here, I believe. So there are four new sectors. Uh, there are a whole bunch of new ships. Uh, Taladi ships. But we haven't... Huh. We don't actually have their wharf open yet. We went over all of this yesterday. Um, so there are... Is there another way we can see this? Maybe. Um, ship comparisons. So we have... Oh, wait, what? We haven't found any of them? No, we haven't found any of the big ships yet. Huh. Oh, we'll find them in due time. So basically, the Argon Federation have gotten two new ships. They have a large behemoth that is new. Um, and the Teladi has, I think, four or six new ships. Walrus. No oh, walrus. Minotaur. Raider. There we go. Uh, got an airdrop. Then ten days later, still... It occurred, so it took back today. I gave her... Shots. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm taking care of Princess. She had an air infection. Oh, that's yeah. nice. Two weeks. Get her airdrops. And ten days later, still no cure. Uh, could it be like mites? No, that is a regular occurrence in uh, these cats, cat, uh, street cats, undomesticated cats. They usually have mites in their ear. Hope she will get better. So of course I'll be a nervous wreck lately. Yeah, I can imagine. Can imagine. She had was last year, huh? Well, I'm no veterinarian, so I'm... I have no answers. I'm just uh, cross my fingers. Princess will be better. All right, let's see here. Can we get to uh, ninety percent? Also, can you guys? Pronounce my name. You, Ulios Sandurus Rusirius Six. That's our name. Say that quick five times in a row. <laughs> All right, maybe three percent, almost there. Almost there, ninety five percent. Ninety six percent. Ninety seven percent. Ninety eight percent. Ninety nine percent. 
And... 100%. Nice. All right. Kestrel, Vanguard. Let's go home to our tiny little Kestrel here. We almost used up a whole... Well, half a tank of oxygen. Hmm. Kestrel, Vanguard. All right, so how is the Marco doing? Where are you? You have actually docked, so that means uh, our captain here, which we're not going to be pronouncing his name. You're going to be working at the Minotaur for a minute as a captain. And then we'll scrap this. She just shake her head sometimes. Uh, something wasn't right. Hmm. Uh, no shields on this bad boy. Um, might not be as profitable as I hoped. There's some. Oh look at that! There's some friend foe mines here. Some regular mines, some tracking mines, and some flares. And well, we're gonna get three hundred and fifty thousand for it, and then we will to sell the the hull afterwards, the chassis. Uh, then what are we doing now? Anyway, any chance for you making any money? Nobody wants to buy our precious flowers. It's not cool. Not cool. Uh, well, we did have the... Uh... Wait, I'm confused. Game so relaxing to watch. Oh, that's nice. Uh, why are you not? Are you not leaving? Well, eventually he might leave. All right, let's um. Let's head back. I think we'll wait a little bit with unlocking the problems at Drift. Is the screen... Wait. Is the green screen black operational? Uh, the green screen is... Um, it's gone. Uh, it's no more. It's trash. Um, so basically, I bought the green screen on Wish and I thought, oh wow, that's a cheap green screen. And when I got it, it was basically just a Big green paper towel, because you know, China. <laughs> Bora Jumpgate, Barren Shores. So yeah, the green screen is not not if. What is that? Yeah, it's it's not uh, operational. It's in the garbage can. Uh, what I have behind me now is just uh, an old um, carpet that I had in my living room. I hung up on the wall. So what took you so long? Entering system, barren shores. Hmm. So the background, well, let me show you. So it's basically just a blanket. Not nothing more than that. Uh, not a blanket, a carpet. Was um, it was uh, 
probably see it in um, in some of my old uh, Christmas calendar videos. I had it in uh, my living room before. No, 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 we're going the wrong way. Right, we'll just hang out here for a minute. How much money do we have? 273. And... Could be that just that it takes a while before the I want to get over here. That means oh also where is our little trader going? He is oh that's why. Oh, because we have spent some of the money buying Electronics. That's why. How much electronics do you have? 89. That's not much. Alright, I know what we're going to do. We're going to go and explore... Uh, this sector here a little bit. Autopilot engaged. Voiceovers are so great. You like it? <laughs> the voiceovers. Yes? No? Sir? Where are you in the world? And maybe you can see it in the background. Uh, so you don't get DMC because they made all the music. No, uh, the music is... Um, is not flagged. Well, it is copyrighted, I guess. But we, we have permission to use it. But yeah, there, there, there is definitely, when we played the Big Ambition, that is definitely a an issue. Entering that system. Game. Watchful gaze. So even though we turned off all the all the music, it still it still played music, which is super stupid. Super stupid. Yes. Docking procedure requested. Well, not quite yet. Where is our trading ship? So, we're going to try and claim these two sectors here. I will not understand this stuff. Well, helium, hydrogen, methane, ore, and silica. So, we have basically everything here except for ice. And we only have ore and silica, so we could potentially claim Watchful Gaze and Heretic's End. Uh, I think we're stuck in... Uh... Yeah, let me 
Autopilot disengage. They control here. They struggle through the um, the rocky part of space. Is it Kansky? Some belly scratching. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like the cat is in a very good mood today. You like some belly scratching. I didn't think you like. Huh. She was purring like a freaking lawnmower. <laughs> Aw, he be cat ski. Yeah, but yeah, the copyright thing is, um, it is serious business. Entering system, heretics end. But I, I don't understand why games do do this stuff, because it's super annoying. Uh, Jump gate, morning star. Don't uh, step on my keyboard. So, the way they get music... I mean, they can make their own music, but if they kind of purchase music from a musician, right? There are several different um, kind of, what should we say, agreements. So some agreements is like, yeah, you can use our music and, and you have the rights to it and such, but, uh, but only you. And that's kind of what I think the big ambitions have done. So basically... Jumpgate, Morning Star. I'm gonna explain that without seeming like an idiot. But yeah, it, it, it is serious uh, if we if we get busted for copyright violations. So, for example, um, um, represent resources. System, morning Star. Uh, the music there. We are allowed to use the music there if we are um, using it in a um, conjunction with the game. Mammoth, thank I am terribly sorry to disrupt your magnificent oh, no. focus. Ozo, what do you want? Nothing. It's just sitting there, washing me. <laughs> Squid man, come on! Alright, I don't have time for this right now. Yeah, I think there is something busted with the dialogues. Entering system. I take vast choice. All right, a little bit of cat tail o'clock. It's fine. Hmm. Let's say hi to the chat up here. You want to do that? Up here. Entering system. <laughs> Silent witness. <laughs> Oh, Katsuki. Such an adorable little creature. I'm on the side. I play my games. Yeah, that's, uh, that's okay. You can play the game, but you can't uh, stream it. That's kind of... Entering system. Profit center alpha. Where the limits of some of the... Uh, copyright thing goes. Right, so... <clears throat> By the way, Tamako, did you have like any other crewmen? No. Uh, any ships here? Excuse me, sir. 
comms uh, channel open. Where can I find the shipyard? Sending you information now. Thank you. Autopilot disengaged. Autopilot engaged. We need some more crew. Have you started moving yet? Yeah, there we go, finally. Stop. Yeah, I know, I know. But well, that's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. I, I do understand it, like, legally. But it is, um... It's annoying. And especially on YouTube, because there are so many... That just take... Uh, they, they just say to YouTube, Yeah, that's actually my music, and then YouTube goes and flags it. It's happened several times with several games. Alright, there is the wharf. Autopilot disengaged. Let's, um. Did we have any, um. Yeah, let's drop a satellite here. It'd be nice. I also wonder. Be here. And I would like to scan the. Bits and pieces here. Tamadi shipyard. I do wonder. Is this a piece we have scanned, or is this a piece we haven't scanned? Hard to tell. I don't. Oi. Cat hairs. Because mm. we kind of would like to scan this to at least 50%. But on Twitch, you can bathe in hot tub. Yeah, but that's not music, right? Unless there is some sort of weird uh, law on the hot tub, uh, hot tub uh, design or something like that. Although I feel like that would be tricky to implement legally. Oh, so the great pieces are the things we haven't scanned. Okay. That makes it a little bit easier to see what we have scanned and what we haven't scanned. Docking granted. No, 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 no don't grant. Well, we could potentially dock here if we like. What else? We are scanning up to 50%. This is not the same color. Oh gosh, another hiccup here. As the other one. I think. Hello there. Is it? I think this is a piece we have scanned. It's so weird. Also, it's a little bit tricky having a cat sleeping on your arm. Trying to navigate space. Thirty three percent. Thirty four percent. Oh, I think that is one of the new ships. E. Yeah, this is one of the new ships. Actually, now that we are here, we could actually look at some of the new ships that they have. Um, so yeah, let's go to the large one first. So all the one that is E is new. So we have the Helion E. Oh, sorry, the, 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 the Heron E and the Heron Vanguard. So this is the old ship. Looks uh, very compact. And this is the new ship. 
It looks a whole lot better. Then we have uh, the crane here. So this is the old crane ship. And then we have the crane E, which is a new one. And then we have the Phoenix Destroyer. This is the old Phoenix. And a new Phoenix, Fe uh, not Felix, Phoenix looks amazing. So this is the new one. And they can actually shoot over this disc here, which is nice. Uh, then we have the extra large. Oh, wait. There were no extra large ships. Fair enough. Uh, we also have some new ships with the Argon. So basically the same thing. They're just longer. Okay, I have a cat here on my nose. Can I get it? Maybe. Maybe. All right, let's go back and scan the the bits and bobs of the station here. Civilian ship D. Accelerators. Let's do it. It's not that far away. Hello there. Should have paid your taxes. Oops. Cat. Ah. Civilian ship D. Yep. That's what you get for not paying your taxes. Teladi Shipyard. Only four percent. Uh, there are some more bits and pieces here we haven't scanned. That's what she said. Well, to pay your taxes? <laughs> oh, you have a cat here on your nose. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Pleasure is all mine. So now we should be able to see how much we're... Teladi Shipyard. Excuse me. Docking. We cannot tolerate your actions. It was a mistake, I, I swear. Um, information. So now we can see what they are, what they have or might not have. Teladi Wharf. And then we'll set over to the Teladi Wharf. Uh, did pirates, pirates? Where? They said pirates, right? No, that isn't longer. Wait, what? Oh, well, that's what she said. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see here. Okay. Ah. You're joking, right? Nutritional expert. What are we fighting? Who are fighting? Somebody's fighting something. I actually don't see it. Well, not my problem. I kind of would like to drop a satellite here. Uh, right, so, oh, hello. Mass transporter F. We'll have your mercy. Spare us. We cannot tolerate. Your actions. It's fine. I did your favor uh, by, you know, taking care of the, the tax evaders. Yes, I'm working for the I I R A. Uh, sorry, silly delay. My laptop. 
TV. No worries. No worries. We figured it out. Docking granted. Eventually, I think. I hope. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, information unlocked, 50%. So we should now be able to see their wares. Okay, we're going to dock here, and I'll show you some of the new stuff. So all the races has gotten a new room, or, or an update to their room. Um down here, I believe. Which is kind of interesting. Let's just, uh... A little bit closer. And we're also gonna hire some, um... Successfully docked. Some new crewmen, I think. Welcome. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, new crew here. Uh, let me get like one of these. Let's transport. All right. So um, all the manager offices and the faction representative office now looks a little bit different. So remember the white room where there was a desk with a. Uh, manager in front of it. Well, now it looks like this. Hello. Hello. Hi. Goodbye. Goodbye. There is a room down here where we sometimes can find some Taladi, which we can hire. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> Thank you. Eat face. Hello. Uh, these are... This is the Teladi. Goodbye. The Teladi room. I really do like this one. Sadly, the uh, the engineering section and the uh, security section looks like hello. Something else. Three thousand. You're hired. You can go and live in my Kestrel. It's a service crew. I will do my best to maximize yes. your company's profits. You do that. Uh, should we also see if we can buy some... Can I help? Here you go. Oh no, pirates, you say? Uh, let's buy one of each of those. Uh, we do actually have some algae scrubbers and some carbon fibers. All right, right. Good profit to you. Thank you, thank you. I'll take that. You want to give this uh, team money so they can uh, make this game. <laughs> I don't Best know. Realm, Vanguard. I think he's more into real life space flight. <laughs> All right. So we do have some crewmen now. Uh, should we have? Let's see. We also did the Mako. No, sorry, the Minotaur. Uh, where are you currently? You're currently here. Give me a. Yes, yes, yes. You can uh, come back here and work as a captain. No. Oh. You can work here as a service crew then. No? Wait, I'm confused. Sir. All right, let's have a sip of Pepsi. Because you know what they say. That's right, Pepsi Max. So glow in the dark. Cheers, boys and girls. <laughs> Yummy, yummy. Uh, gee, Pepsi for my yummy. Uh, 
Yes. Now, why couldn't you... Can I help? ...work somewhere else? Could you become a manager? Yeah, you can become a manager. Confirmed. At our headquarters. And then we'll sell the Minotaur. Uh, oh, that's nice. Now we have one million credits. Excellent. That means we're going to buy another medium uh, turn. But was he... Wait, 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 wait. Was weird. He streamed Diablo 4. Yeah, you know. <laughs> he has the money to buy all the, the stuff in Diablo. All the microtransactions. <laughs> um, no, we're not going to go high preset. Let's just do... You're going to travel for a long time, so I think we're going to give you a travel engine. Yes, and thruster. We're gonna give you some shields, and some pulse turrets, and that should be enough. We can give give you some flares. Control already up to six hundred thousand. Right, let's do it. One minute, and then we'll get another. Raider. Uh, then we're gonna go and grab. What was it? Electronics, energy cells, all parts, and water. I'm guessing the new path of exile will be in the future. I don't know if I'm going to play ex uh, the path of exile. There's so many games that comes out. Uh, so we, we, we do have like in a week or so. Uh, we're going to get a new DLC for RimWorld. A horror themed um, DLC. Alright. Oh, you don't actually have an entire star. Can I help? Uh, give me a second. Do, do we have a better pilot? No, it's terrible. Stupid lizard. Can I help? Uh, yeah, could you... Um... Goodbye. Uh, do we have any better pilots? The best pilot have zero stars. Sir. Wow. Uh, we need at Can least... <laughs> we need at least one uh, pilot. Uh, one star pilot. Is that going to bring you all the way up to one star? Goodbye. Estrel Vanguard. Yes. Okay, that's actually pretty good. All right. You, Rim World, sign me up, of course. Of course, of course, said the horse. We're gonna be um, transfer crew. We're just gonna replace captains. What do you mean, no captains? No captains assigned. Oh, no, no, no. Exchange. There we go. Confirm. Into the pod you go. Bump. There we go. He's gone. Um, so, did you get your new captain? Yes, yes. And you're going to be repeat orders. Confirm. Yes. And then we're going to go... Uh, 
here. Here we're going to be buying. Do we press the buy button? Uh, I hear your cat ski going on my nerves. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Electronics, and then we'll sell it. Here, sell to electronics. Okay, and then we'll get whole parts. Whole parts. Confirm. Now, whole parts. And energy cells. And then, let's see here. Cell to energy cells. Yes, yes. Still nobody wants to buy my flowers. Like, literally nobody. <laughs> Alright. Requesting immediate backup. So we have used up all our money now. Interesting. Okay, give me one second. The cat is meowing like a crazy person. What is it, Katsuki? Tell me. Show me. Show me. You didn't even beg for treats. All right, where are we? Uh, the Marco we're gonna need. Uh, how far have we gotten on on this quest here? We have only delivered eighty nine Claytronics. Okie dokie. Uh, maybe we should do some quests. Get some... Um... Get some... Um... We can do a little bit of exploration while the traders are at bay. Uh, we can go off to the split sectors, by the way, when I think about it. Should be there, if I recall correctly. Uh, we're going to head over to the um, three families. The Zyarth Patriarchy is probably... Probably hate us. New balance. 23 credits. Is that all we have? Oh my. Could also see if we can do some sort of pirus. Oh no. I always forget. Hey, I hey. think I know where we are. I'm pretty sure those star patterns match the ones from the pre-shutdown gate maps. This is the way to the old Federation. Okay. 
Uh, we'll uh, escort this guy. Uh, wait, did you just... Because we do get some reputation for this, I believe. Easy wrap. With the, um... Tuatara. You know, I think we're actually free. Yay! We got him. Plus eight in reputation with the Argon Federation. That is a lot of friend foe mines we don't have to blow up. So, um, so yeah, we will head over to the three families. And then we can show you the, um, the new split. Um. Entering system, two grand. The new splat, uh, splat, the new, <laughs> new splat, yeah. The new split, um. What the heck is it called? Manager station. Eat space. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, you're gonna sleep on the keyboard, aren't you? What if I Entering move the keyboard? System. Fires of defeat. All right. So let's stop at a split, split defense platform station here. Granted. This is also a cool little place. Imagine if I was so smart that I actually installed some, some docking software on the ship. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Don't take off yet. So this is the new split uh, area. So you can come in here. What do you want? Yeah, nice to meet you too. You go now. <laughs> yes, we go now. All right. So this is the new uh, split manager station, um, managing manager office. Uh, since we are actually are on a station, we could probably see if there is any... Uh, actually, we only have a couple of credits, right? Can I help? Oh, Here maybe. You go. No. Huh. Well, we only have 23 credits to our name. So. You go now. Yes, yes. Estrel, Vanguard. So the um Civilian ship, C. Hello there. We don't want to die. Spare us. Yes, well no, we won't spare you. Docking granted. That's a small joke. You should have paid your taxes. 
No loot. It's rough. All right. Let's explore some of the um, systems here. Oh wait, what the heck happened here? A Zyoth Raptor? In Morningstar? Fighting an Argon defense platform? Interesting. Docking aboard. Thanks for your help. Oh, my pleasure. My pleasure. There it is. Uh, another thing we probably should do, and that is actually become a little bit more friendly with the Zyoth patriarchy. As uh, we're going to be neighbors with them. Yeah. We would like them to uh, trade with us, make profits. Entering system, Argus Ravine. Yeah, that's probably what we should do. We should uh, we should uh, help the Zyarth Patriarchy, or at least get friendly with them so we can trade with them before they got eaten up by the Xenon. That's usually how things go. Entering system. Fires of defeat. And 105 credits. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted. Oh, are we crashing something? We did. I am tempted to sell the the Marco, but we kind of need three of these uh, for the next uh, quest line. The Borons. Dragon. It doesn't. I don't think they will attack us on sight. Or maybe, since we're flying a military vessel or a scouting vessel. Um. Zyoth Patriarchy. Entering system. Two grand. No, they won't target us. Okay, good. Another thing we should look at, and that is global order. We will like create a new blacklist, sector travel, civilian ship, military ship. You're not allowed to go into enemy territory. Uh, safe travel. Save.
entering system. Open market. Uh, open market. Uh, this goes into the Argon sectors, right? This goes into the Zion of the Matriarchy systems. Are you guys seriously not going to be selling anything? reset this um, who had inventory you have inventory uh, trade with build storage yeah, sell them all of that and when you're done go and buy some more old parts well we don't have money for that so they're gonna have to go and now this first. All right, crew, we are entering Zyrath Patriarchy object. systems. Need to be ready. Rattlesnake. Jump gate, unknown sector. Oh, hello there. Entering system, family newt. Family newt. We are looking for tax evaders. Any tax evaders here? Civilian ship C. That is a yes. Now we're going to be a little bit careful here so we don't accidentally shoot the station. This ship is done for. Please stop shooting. Oh, he's gone. Medical supply factory. So we'll just jump from uh, station to station and find those pesky pesky tax evaders. Anyone? Did you all pay your taxes? Thanks for your help. You're welcome. No tax evaders at the medical station. Be a little bit more patient, I believe. There's always some scumbags that try to evade paying their taxes. all the drones at C 
civilian ship D. D for there we go. No, don't. Too late. Always somebody that doesn't want to pay their taxes. I must perform a long range scan. Unknown object. I feel like the tanks. Object. Satellite. It's a freaking satellite. That's not what we Tuatara. want. Tuatara. Tuatara is also not what we want. We want a station. He kind of is close enough. We'll just get on friendly terms with them. We can do some trades. Civilian ship C. Okay. Sorry, didn't get that. Unknown station. Wreck. Wreck. Unknown station. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. That many... It's minus nine we need to be. Or we can dock at their stations. Civilian ship B. All right. Uh, can we get you? No. Uh, yes. All right. Next station. Up Unknown here. station. So that should put us to uh, minus eleven. Right. Scanning array factory. Yes. Thank you. It's eleven. Getting close. Civilian ship D. No. Right. Next ship. Claytronics factory. Next station, was that minus 10? Claytronics factory. Wait a 
you're doing, Katsuki. Thanks for your help. Yeah, minus ten. I think the next one should be. Should put us to uh, neutral with the Zyoth Patriarchy. Claytronics Factory. Civilian ship C. Hmm. Hello there. Halt, criminal scum. Oh gosh. It's taking off. Please don't kill us. Well, you know, I need my reputation. Now, it could be that we need one more. Let's perform another long range scan here. Unknown station. Uh, this way. I wonder what that sound is. your help. Ah, there we go. We can now dock with them. Okay, so we're not going to be doing another one. And they want us to go in here. Let's object. follow this. This is going to lead us down to Heretic's End eventually. I do believe. Oh my, power sneeze. Entering system. Family Zin. Family Zin, you say. Still, nobody wants to buy my precious flowers. Thief, stop them! Ah, I'm busy. I'm busy, busy. Entering system. Wretched skies. Also, we do have a couple of uh, messages we've gotten. What is that? Jump gate, second draft, that's an Amankaret. Uh, Bosota, Gelnat, Agile Peace, Inheritic N, Collaborative uh, Notification, and Unique oh, for Hatikva. We could start doing the Hatikva questline as well, just to get everything going. At once, which is um, scan clear. Carry on. Oh, I, I, I didn't know we were scanned. There you go. <laughs> there you go.
Entering Wretched Skies 5 Family Phi. So how I, I see this is we're going to be trading because the Boron and the Split, the Zion of Patriarch, they are, if I recall this correctly. So we're going to be operating as a mediator and making profits, both of them. So setting up a shop here in Heretic's End and selling to both the Zion and the... Entering Boron. system, Heretic's End. Or profiteering, yes. That's uh, that's the name of the oh, game. Wonderful. You are here to deal with that sensor distorting ship. No, Bozo. No. Your much anticipated arrival fills me with considerable relief and delight. Sorry to hear that. I don't want to start. I hate this quest. <laughs> I hate it with a passion. Uh, let's head over to. Here. And what we can do, we can go down to Faulty Logic 2 and see if we can pick up that. Uh, um, Entering system, wretched skies. No, this is not where I wanted to go. Uh, we would like to go down here. Autopilot engaged. So we're gonna get a couple of millions from that, I would imagine. And we do have some crewmen with us, right? Yes. One of them. And uh, we could also go to Nobleus Fortune and pick up that free ship that is... Um, uh, what is it here? Grand Exchange. Entering system. Heretics so we're gonna have end. to. Ice Mist, isn't that where the Gate to Nobleus Fortune is? Yeah, maybe we should do that. We'll pick up that ship as well. I know there are a couple of other ships. Uh, there should be a ship in Silent Witness. That's just a tiny ship. Or a small ship. So silent misses two. What is it? Silence witness three. Entering system. Morning star. So let's go and greet the xenon. Have we actually found any cog? I don't think we have. What do you want? You go now. Didn't quite look like a Vigor Syndicate ship. Oh, wait. Is it Gladius here? Wait, 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 wait. An SE ship? Is this a new... Uh, Aaron ship? No, sorry, a uh, Xenon ship? Ah. Entering system. Patikva's choice. This might be risky because there is a there is a gate here that leads into a xenon. 
territory, so we're gonna have to be quick. Gladius. Autopilot disengaged. There's a lot of broken ships here. Uh, it seems like the majority of them are... Just bits. Gladius. Oh, I think we collided in it. No, 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 don't, don't send it in there. Oh, no, 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 you, you are... Yeah, you're not moving. Yeah, I think we nudged it a little bit. Alright. A lot of booms. Sestrel Vanguard. Oh, 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 oh. Are you gonna be attacking me? Gladius. Let's pretend that he doesn't see me. I'm going to wipe you out. There is the Okay, we kind of would like to be on this side here, just in case. Right? I'll make sure you regret that. Uh, it seems like they're fighting the, um... Terran. Oh gosh, I hope they're fighting the Terran. Uh, no, they're fighting me! Oh, we're dead. We're dead. I will hide behind the ship. Okay, can we? This is not good. This is not good at all. Okay, Castrel, I know you are a terrible, lousy little ship. Remove all orders and assignment. Attack this ship, please. No! What happened? No, my little shit! No! This didn't go well. Hmm. Are you still hunting me down, or are you? Yeah, we are losing everything. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> this is GG. Oh, man. We should have just picked it up, got into the ship, and flown away. Uh, load game. Where is the autosave? Ten. That's a half an hour we're going to lose. Well, better than restarting, I guess. My oh my. Progress can be have lost in half an hour. 25 minutes. I guess all the activators we took down. We're gonna have to redo that. Uh, yes, that's what we're gonna have to do. And we're also gonna have to set up a. Um, I think we're also going to have to set up the um, trading ships we have to go and manually go and sell the goods that they have. Entering system. Open market. Open market. Okay. Um, yeah, so we are kind of far away. Uh, we're going... Excuse me. That way. And these. You're just going to go and manually sell this.
And we have 105 credits. Wonder if it's still there, the Gladius. And it doesn't look like it. Hello there. Entering uh, system, yep. family, newt. So, blast away some uh, new criminal scum. It's gonna be nice. I'll scan some stations while we wait. Oh, hello there! Jeepus! <laughs> Are you alright? It's just a bender bender, alright. Civilian ship D. Medical supply factory. Fourteen or minus fourteen. Hopefully we don't have to wait too long to find the activators. Object. Unknown station. That's minus thirteen. Unknown station. Thank you. Weapon component factory. Scan clear. Carry on. Thank you. Civilian ship D. Next. Unknown station. Minus twelve. So theoretically, we have been quite lucky. Thanks for your help. With 
how quickly the um, red mineral vessels show themselves. Civilian ship B. Uh, next ship. I will unknown station. Go up there, I think. Oh, this minus Thanks for your help. Ten, no, minus eleven. Kidoki. And this one is going to be minus ten. Uh, where? I don't see it. It's all the way down here. Fake news. Put it themselves. Well, if they did, scanning array factory, unknown station. We'll jump over to the next one. Unknown station. Civilian ship B. All integrity is marginal. Please stop. Caught him. Claytronics factory. Well, that was uh, minus ten, right? And then the next one is. 
going to be what allow us to dock at their station. Nope, excuse me. Civilian ship, C. Yeah, uh, working on it. There he is. Thank you. You're welcome. Minus 10 and minus 9. Good. All right, that should do it. That should do it. Now I'm just a little bit disorganized here. Um, Autopilot engaged. You're flying an autopilot on, right? All right, give us a good news. Boa. And blue. Thanks for your help. Yeah, now they're all blue. So that means we can dock at their station. We are officially friendly with Entering the... Entering system. Family. Zin. Patriarchy. It's a shame that we lost that ship over here. We'll, we'll fly down here after. After we get to Heretic's End. Autopilot disengaged. Yeah, I have a feeling you're gonna crash in that station. Funny little feeling I have. We had the autopilot on. Entering system. Wretched skies. Unknown object. Unknown object. Unknown object. Don't know what that doo -doo -doo sound is. Entering wretched skies. Five family. Five. E five four five. Entering system. Heretics end. Autopilot engaged. Okay. 
If that doesn't work, we'll just go down here and we'll take the Hitikwa Trade Guild and then we'll get a ship. We'll sell that ship since it's not a Terran ship. Sorry, it, since it's not a Pilati ship. And, um... Would have been nice to have a better ship. For the... Next part of the plan. Oh, actually, we don't have enough reputation Entering for system. it. Entering system. Morning star. Um, probably. Do we want a peregrine or an osprey? Hard to tell. Yes, we're also gonna have to. Wait, don't you guys have anywhere to mine? We could mine here, graphite, so we could do a gas miner here, uh, silicon refinery, well we only have 3,000 credits so... Oh, Sensor distorting ship? Uh, not quite, Bozo. Your much anticipated arrival fills me with considerable relief and delight. Not quite yet, my friend. You guys, are you, uh... Not quite there yet. Uh, there is a lot of Vigor Syndicate ships here. Should we join the fray here? Autopilot disengaged. Oh, Try harder next time. See if we can get some money for. Ammunition container. There's some weird pinging noises. Interesting. Can we get in on Corral that action? Coming. No. Okay. We're just gonna get up and tell our captain here to. Go and pick up all the good loot. Sir? Yes. Go and collect all the good stuff here. There probably is some good stuff up here as well. So we're just gonna sit in the back here. Uh, you're gonna attack us? Yeah, of course you are. Estrel, Vanguard. Autopilot, disengaged. Corral Kami. Yeah, he's gone. All right, you can go back. Jeebus. This bad situation. So a lot of space battle going on up here. Defense drone. I wonder if it's this thing here that kind of makes the binging. Binging. The syndicate is. Um, I'll wipe you out. Non stop. 
Raider ship. Yeah, there is no uh, free ship for us here. You're going to regret that. You won't be able to hold out against us. But there are some loot. There's also a free family boa here that almost didn't survive. Oh, wait, we are following the wrong ship. Estrel, Vanguard. What he's up to. Eat an asteroid. Eat space. Oh, I'm shaky. Well, at least they are in the right sector. No slow. <laughs> they are so incredibly slow. What the heck? Get away from that station, what the heck? Estrel, Vanguard. No, just get away. Autopilot, autopilot. What's going on? Oh, I think they actually were... Yeah. Autopilot. I think they actually were attacking the uh, the Xenom uh, here, and we just got trapped in the. I'm not gonna get any of that, I guess. That was spooky. Yeah, I don't think it actually was me they were attacking. <laughs> yeah, I think there was something else they were shooting at. Maybe this guy here? P.E. Actually, losing money on this. We're buying them for two hundred and fourteen, and selling them for one hundred and seventy. Comrade, I don't think that was a good deal. Yeah, we are not making any money on this. We are actually losing money on this. Holy moly. I thought they would... Is that weird sound? It is the... <gasps> it's the tracker mine! Vanguard. Run! It's this guy Truck here. In. No, no, no. This guy. Tracker mine. Autopilot. Disengaged. Okay. 
this guy here. Holy moly. Alright. Back to business. Sir. Sir. Pick up all the loot. Can I help? S12, Vanguard. All block ejecting. Nope. <laughs> Emergency eject successful. <laughs> Oh no, well, our pilot managed to survive. I wonder where he's gonna go. You have any plans? Ow. <laughs> With that, I do think we're gonna be calling it a day. Ah! That means we're gonna have to redo all the other stuff again. I'll, I'll probably do that off camera before next stream. So, uh, so yeah, with that, I just want to say, um, Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, there should be a um, like button, a comment section. Of course, there is a red or a green follow button, depending on where you're watching. If you're watching on Rumble, it should be a green follow button. If you're watching on YouTube, it should be a red subscribe button. Interacting with it always uh, help us fight that pesky, pesky algorithm. So, uh, so yeah, again, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Until next time, take care. Keep smiling. Bye-bye.